Hi there, this is Leo from ThemeChills.com. First and foremost, I just wanted to say thanks for purchasing the theme. And what I'll be showing you in this video is how to set up the Reprise responsive landing page. It's really easy, so let's get going. Now, one thing I'd like to point out is this video will show you how you can go about um, uploading the template through FTP using cPanel. Now there are other applications that you can use. Um, Dreamweaver has a built-in FTP service. I think FileZilla is another one. But uh, for the purpose of this video, I'll be showing you how to do so with cPanel. So what I'll do first is open up my cPanel and we'll go into File Manager. I'll click on Go. And for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to create a new directory and we'll call it test. And I'll click on the create new folder. Now you'll be able to upload this to the root if you wanted to, but uh, because I'm just showing you this video as a demo, we'll be uploading it to the test folder. Next. Once you've purchased the Reprise landing page, you'll receive a zip file, which would look like this. Now, it'll probably be labeled a bit different to what it shows here, but uh, nonetheless, it'll still be a zip file. So, once you've downloaded the zip file, what you need to do is obviously extract the contents of it. And we don't need the zip file anymore, so I'm just going to delete that. Next we'll check the contents of the template and here you'll see that you have the Photoshop files you'll also have the HTML and the documentation which you can go through um, if you want to uh, otherwise you can just check out the video and uh, that'll pretty much explain how you go about doing this as well so because we'll be uploading the HTML file I'll access it and what I do with cPanel, it may be different if you use Dreamweaver or, as I said, FileZilla or any other FTP um, uploading service. But uh, through cPanel, I actually will compress my files. And I'm just going to call it Demo. Next, I'm going to go into my cPanel console and I'm going to upload. I'm going to choose file. And I'll just need to go to the location where the demo zip file was created. So I'll start uploading that. And then you'll see it'll start uploading down here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video for a moment while it does its business and then I'll come back to you. Okay, so now the template has been uploaded to the server. As you can see, it's complete. So what I'll do, I'll go back and I'll need to extract the contents from the demo zip file. So I'll do that now, extract, extract file, yes. I'll close that out. I'll reload and I no longer need the demo zip file so I'll delete that. So as you can see all the contents of the template is now on the server and what I'll need to do is just go to the corresponding directory and it should be ready to go. Um, just so you can see I'm just gonna do that now okay and I'll just bring that down so you can actually see the location. So it's hosted on the themechills.com forward slash test and pretty much you have the working version ready to go. And let me just check that the map is there. Yeah, it's working great. As is the form. And let's make sure that the smooth scroll works. Great, the JavaScript has kicked in. And let's now see that they're modal. Fantastic. 
So that's pretty much how easy it is to install the reprise landing page on your server. As I said, if you do have other FTP programs such as Dreamweaver, I think Cyberduck is another one, FileZilla, pretty much just follow the necessary instructions and you should be good to go. So I hope you enjoyed the video and if you do have any questions feel free to contact me through the item description and I'll be happy to, to help you out. Thanks for watching and for all the latest updates feel free to go to themechills.com and you'll be able to see what I'm up to. Until next time, bye.